You see them everywhere, people on e-bikes and scooters, but there's a potential danger. Sometimes the batteries can explode, turning those vehicles into fireballs. We found out why and what you can do to stay safe. Electric scooters and electric bikes bursting into flames. This guy is lucky to be alive. He hops off his electric bicycle just as the battery suddenly catches fire. It was probably the scariest thing I've ever, ever gone through. Daniel and Linda Jones of Pittsburgh, California lost everything when they say their electric scooter burst into flames. Not even a minute later, the, the whole front of the house is on fire. In New York City, e-battery related fires are up a whopping 233% in just two years, resulting in 163 injuries and 10 deaths, including five-year-old Erica Williams, who was killed when her apartment building in Harlem went up in flames. Is this a fairly typical battery that you would charge? Yes, this is a fairly typical battery that is seen on a lot of e-bikes. Electrical engineer Brad Davis told our Lisa Guerrero many fires are caused by overcharging or faulty batteries. To demonstrate, Davis and his team took yes. this battery. It's fully charged and in good yes. condition. Then all he does is deliberately overcharge it. So now we're going to take the battery that's connected to the charger and put it on the chair, as many people unfortunately do. 52 minutes tick by here at the New Haven Fire Training Academy in Connecticut. Oh my gosh, there's smoke coming out of it right now. Yep, it's going to happen here. Bill, get out of there. Get out, get out. Even under careful supervision and a controlled environment, we had a close call. As soon as I saw the smoke start to come out of the battery, Within seconds. Within seconds. It caught fire. Yep, that's pretty typical. Could this happen in somebody's house? Absolutely. Just like this? Just like this. This is very typical of what we would expect. The very, very violent eruption of fire. Bill, get out of there. Get out. Get out. Safety experts say it is critical to always follow the manufacturer's instructions for charging and storing your e-bike or scooter battery.